great American road trip does not have to be just for the two legged kids in your family. Bringing our four legged buddies along means quite a bit more preparation to keep them safe and healthy as well. So here are some pet safety tips from animal experts. Hitting the open road for a family vacation has long been a tradition, but what about our four legged friends? When I say they become our family, they really have become our kids for so many pet owners. Jonna Devereaux, a clinical pet nutritionist, shares with us some pet road trip survival tips. For starters, bring a little home with you. So when we think about getting in a car and driving, that's not necessarily stressful for us, but for some dogs, it can become a stressful experience. Yawning a lot, drooling, and licking their lips can be cues that they're stressed. So bringing something that they're familiar with may help chill them out. Whether it be a bed or a favorite toy, or if you have a dog that's a chewer, you can bring a safety device like a bully buddy. Chew toys can be a good distraction for them. And chewing supports a healthy mental state. Things like blankets and dog beds also help. That sense of smell really does make an association that can provide them with comfort and ease. Next, take care of their motion sickness. And if you have a pet that's never been on a car ride, I'm going to say set them up for success and don't make the first time they're in the car when you're about to get on the road for 100 miles. Take them around the block and on short trips to see how they handle it. If it turns out they do have issues with car rides. There are some things that you can naturally do to help their body. And one of them is to give them a natural, what we consider a spice, it's ginger. It comes in powder or liquid form and it settles their stomach. You can actually even buy ginger root from the grocery store, tuck it into some peanut butter if you needed to, and you'd wanna give that at least 30 minutes before you get in the car. Finally, make a pet travel kit. You have the obvious of their food bowl, food, some of their favorite treats, water, of course. Just to be extra safe, pack for a worst case scenario dog gets lost, you need to have pictures. God forbid your dogs get hurt or your dog gets hurt. You're going to want to pack a first aid kit. It's also a good idea to have vaccination documents to cover all your bases. The most important part is to just have fun. Buckle up the pups with these pet road trip tips.